Privacy is a complex and challenging risk in today's world. One of the greatest sources of privacy risk are your employees, because every time they touch data or make a decision about data, they can create privacy exposure for you. In this video, we're going to hear from global privacy experts on how to create a culture of privacy to help address those risks and help improve privacy for your company. The way to get people to lead and believe in privacy is to make it everybody's business, to bring it to their own. Why does it matter to you? Why does it matter to what you do? And then to make it really a business issue. Why is privacy critical for our business? If you don't create a culture of privacy within an organization, though, what you risk is the fact that you have a strong legal department that really understands the issue. Uh, you may even have a really strong engineering department that understands the issue, but there are going to be gaps throughout your organization where that awareness will not exist. You need smart people in the right places making good decisions. Now that doesn't mean that every person in your organization has to be a PhD in privacy. It's not going to happen. What you need is role-based understanding so that someone has the ability to understand that a privacy issue is in front of them and either resolve it or elevate it appropriately. That everybody understands that even somebody who doesn't handle personal information or data at all in their day-to-day -day activities, when they do stumble upon it, even by mistake, they need to understand how it important it is to the organization. You have to make sure that the workforce understands Privacy is a team sport. Everybody plays. Anytime they touch a piece of personal information, they know they have to follow uh, the correct processes and procedures. A comprehensive privacy training program can alter your corporate culture and turn something that may have been a weakness into a strength. At the same time, if something bad does happen, a good privacy training program will help shorten response times, and improve your overall results. We all know that there are going to be data breaches. It's the understanding of what a data breach is. It's how to try to prevent it. It's how to manage it when it occurs. Those are the issues that are part of the training and education and awareness that needs to occur. The front page of the New York Times, no institution wants their name there aligned with a mishap. You need to have those people trained to understand how your company's thinking about the issue of privacy, what the guidelines are internally at your company for how data will be handled, as well as making it personal to every single person at the company. We all have responsibility for treating each other's data the way we'd want our own data treated. Your customers have a lot of expectations of your company. When they engage with you, they expect that you're going to manage their data. In fact, they expect that you're going to manage their data well. In today's world, it is without question that your customers expect you are going to do right with their data. I think you just have to train over and over again. And you, you want to train to the point where the workforce considers privacy not to be something that, that they have to do, that they have to check the box, but you want to train to the point where privacy becomes just this innate value to the individual person in the workforce, that they think of it almost like muscle memory. Still, a recent study showed that less than half of organizations are requiring privacy training. In the end, if your employees can't make good decisions about data, if when they are presented with a choice about privacy, they don't know how to make a good decision, your efforts are going to fail. And so you have to invest in employee training. Without privacy, we may not have trust. We may not be able to sell our products. We may not be able to engage with our business partners because there's going to be a competitor who's going to be better if we don't do this right. It's also understanding the lifeblood of your organization in this digital economy is data. And that means getting privacy right.